Pat Doherty here at IMG Boletary Tennis Academy in Bradenton, Florida. Joining me today is Elizabeth Sutherland. She's a full-time student in our full-time program. Today we want to introduce you to a new series and a new component that we've introduced at the Academy called High Performance Teaching. A lot of cool concepts we're going to share with you over the next few months. Let's get started. I want to introduce you to the Athletic Foundation. Now as part of this, you'll notice that we have a device on Elizabeth here that attaches to her ankles and this makes her very aware of how her athletic foundation is performing while she's hitting. Athletic foundation refers to the total body posture. Let me show you specifically what I'm talking about. Elizabeth has very good back posture here. Her hips are, have an angle in there, a good lower back posture here. Good angle of inflection close to 45 degrees at the knees and if you look at the base she's almost two shoulder widths apart. And that's really important because when the feet are too close together, it's hard for the player to stay down at a desired height. It puts too much stress on the knees. So a wider base allows her to distribute that weight up into the hips and make for a nice sturdy position. When I say sturdy, it's like a building, structural integrity. It's got to withstand heavy winds. There's a lot of force and momentum that happens to a tennis player. So when I push on her, you can see she's not even budging. Now, as a great test of this foundation, I love to do the still drill, and what's great about it, the kids love it even more than I do. Let me demonstrate the still drill for you now. You see she gets her feet set up very quickly. She's really balanced, and what she's trying to do is keep her body as still as possible. And she'll get great power from this, because a lot of power is wasted when the body's wiggling around a whole lot. This is a great drill, and they can usually really rock the ball when they do it this way. Now with this cord attached to her, anytime she feels it pull on her, that means she's launching up. So it's a great reminder of when she's staying in the zone of good athletic foundation height and when she's deviating. She's showing us a really good example of the still drill right now. So now you've seen a great example of the still drill. It's a great way to get the feeling of maximum power, control, accuracy, and the lesson of less is more. Now we want to show you the athletic foundation in movement and the secrets to smooth, fluid, and effortless movement.